Hey, you cool cats and kittens. Sorry, I couldn't resist. Anyway, uh, this is Bruce here with The Aquarium Life, and today I'm going to be comparing the uh, less expensive API test kit with uh, Salford's test kit. Uh, specifically, today we're doing nitrate. Alright, so welcome to The Aquarium Life. Today's video, we're going to be comparing the uh, less expensive API test kit to the uh, uh, more reputable Salifert test kit. Specifically, we're doing nitrate today. So let's uh, just jump right into the testing and then we can kind of go over results and opinions and all that kind of good stuff. Okay, so the API test kit, you're spending, um, I think you're around maybe $10 or so for the, the nitrate test kit. Uh, if you wanted to get the whole, uh, you know, uh, master test kit, then you're about $25, something like that. Uh, the Salifert kit is a little bit more expensive. Both kits are very easy to use. I'll illustrate right here. We've got two different uh, water samples, so I'm going to do two different tests. And we're going to cap that, mix that. You're supposed to shake this bottle here for 30 seconds or so. Um, Ten more drops. And then we're supposed to mix that up really good and give it about uh, three minutes or so. And now let's go over here to the uh, Salifert kit. One milliliter of water. Uh, both of these kits are brand new. We have four drops, and we're supposed to put in one teaspoon of the powder, or one spoonful of the powder, not teaspoon. Swirl that up, and here again we're waiting about three minutes to get our results. Okay, I ran um, two tests on the API with each one just to show there's one factor with these test kits that you want to keep in mind is, is it going to be consistent from test to test? Well, uh, you can definitely see that uh, both tests came up almost identical. Um, you know, we're running uh, on this one maybe uh, in the 20 to 40 parts per million range. And on this one we're running uh, maybe I would guesstimate over a hundred parts per million and that's based on uh, my eyesight the way I'm perceiving the colors uh, it may be a little bit different for you but we know that hey this is out of hand this is way too high we need to do something about these uh, nitrates this we're like okay this is moderate maybe we're you know getting to the point where we really need to do a water change uh, this is a reef tank you know we definitely want to do a water change uh, but it's not that bad. This is like, hey, let's uh, let's take some action, corrective action here, and get that taken care of. Now, over here to the um, to the Salifert, and this is obviously our uh, water sample. We got about a uh, 40 parts per million on the uh, on the API, and I'm sending a little bit less on this, maybe closer to uh, 25. And then uh, this is the one where we got closer to 100 and, you know, I'd say, you know, about 100 parts per million maybe. So both of these test kits are telling me, hey, this one's uh, moderate, this one's severe. Uh, do I need to know if it's 102 parts per million versus 100 parts per million? No. I just need to know about where that's at. Okay. All right, so here's my two cents. Uh, 
let's say, you know, I, I've been around a lot. I've seen a lot of uh, bigger corporations and, uh, you know, uh, depending, you know, I'm not going to say any names, but, you know, some of those are using the API test kits for the, uh, just for nutrient levels, like the, the nitrate, nitrite, and stuff like that. And, uh, you know, I can, it makes sense. It's, it's a less expensive test kit if you're doing, uh, you know, hundreds and hundreds of tests uh, per month. That's going to add up to some significant savings. And it's also going to get you right in the ballpark of where you need to be. Now, uh, you know, if you're a hobbyist and you're just occasionally doing these tests, you don't know, mind spending a little extra for, you know, a, a salifer test. Uh, you know, that, that makes a lot more sense. So my conclusion here is that the verdutrient, uh, ammonia, nitrate, and nitrite, I think that the API is perfectly fine. Um, I would really love to know what you guys think. So I, I'm doing this video. I'd love to have some feedback, you know, uh, see, see what you guys think, how you feel about it. Uh, I really appreciate you guys watching the video, and uh, I plan on doing a lot more uh, videos with... Uh, research we're going to send in some water samples to some labs and uh, we're going to delve a little further into test kits accuracy and all that kind of stuff so stay tuned for that uh, please follow me on instagram it's vital underscore reef and uh, again thank you so much for watching